Step aside or don't. But let's get this train moving. Let's get this thing going. Four months after Joshua versus Usyk, we're talking about rematch clauses and is he going to step aside? Is he not going to step aside? Is Fury going to fight Usyk right away? Is Fury going to fight Dillian White? Who's going to fight who? We're months after Fury versus Wilder. How many times did Tyson Fury fight in 2021? How many times did Deontay Wilder fight in 2021? How many times did Alexander Usyk fight in 2021? How many times did Anthony Joshua fight in 2021? Do you see where I'm going with this? The four top heavyweights in the world fought four times combined in 2021. Problem one. Problem number one is the chronic inactivity from fighters in boxing today. I've gone over it in previous videos. 15 of the top 20 pound for pound fighters in the world fought once in 2021 and don't you dare blame the pandemic. Don't you dare. These other sports leagues got it going. Chronic inactivity. Number two, things take too long to develop. And I already know there's going to be people in the comment section, oh, Calix, you don't get the business side of it. Um, you know, there's a rematch clause. And then, you know, it takes work and lawyers got to get involved. And, you know, there's a mandatory here. There's a mandatory there. I don't care. I've told you a million times on this channel. I come from, from the point of view on this channel as a boxing fan. And what I'm telling you, repeatedly is I know so many people that I came into this with into YouTube in 2010, 2011, who left the sport of boxing as fans because they got tired of this and they got tired of complaining about stuff and other content creators telling them you need to stop complaining because it's just the business side of boxing and boxing is a business. I get that boxing is a business, but at some point, at some point, the sport aspect of it has to reach that balance. Right now, it's business, sport, right here. At what point is there an equal balance? Until there is a balance, fans are down there. Fans are left behind because from where I'm sitting, fighters are happy. Promoters are happy. Managers are happy. Networks are happy. Guess who's not happy? Boxing fans. I go to UFC fight parties. UFC fight fans are happy. Maybe the fighters aren't happy. And maybe there's some unevenness there in that sport. But I'll tell you what, the fans are happy because they're getting the fights they want. And they're getting the best fighting the best. And they're getting entertaining matchups. And they're getting deep cards. What are we getting? And what I'm telling you is get this thing moving. I don't want to hear Tyson Fury side of it, Anthony Joshua side of it, Usyk side of it, Wilder side of it. I'm tired of all the interviews. I'm tired of the Twitter fighting. I'm tired of the Instagram back and forth. Fight. Fight. Get to it. Fury and Usyk could fight right now. And the winner would be, the winner would be the first undisputed heavyweight champion in two decades. One fight away from that. But I'm told we can't have that. Because of rematch clauses and mandatories and step asides and all this nonsense. Well, if that's the case, get to it. Get Joshua and Usyk in the ring right now. Get it done in March. Get it done in April. Let's go. But I already know what's going to happen. And mark my words right now. Save this. Screenshot it. Record it, do whatever you want with it. Start it now. These all, all these all four of these guys fought once in 2021. Guess how many times they're gonna fight in 2022? All four of them are gonna fight once. Watch. Mark my words. Mark my words. Because I can already see the pace of this. It's not adding up. The math is not mathing. This is taking way too long to develop. I'm getting frustrated as a boxing fan. I'm tired of seeing this in every division, on every level, with the exception of a few, with the exception of the Canelos of the world, the Chocolatitos, who's about to fight again in March. 
who wanted to fight Estrada and will likely fight Estrada before the year, year is out. Watch. But with the exception of those guys and, and, and a few others, these fighters ain't it today, man. They're not it. They're not it. This ain't a pretty sight right now. And if I got to be the one to say it, so be it. But get to it. Step aside. Don't step aside. Get to it. It's time. Give us an undisputed heavyweight champion. Or at least give us some fights.